and I'll be damned if a man tell me my breath stink. First of all, your mama stink. How about that? Baby, not come on now, not five percent. We just getting started. Hey gems, it's Grandma Shimima, and we are back at it again with another mother freaking vlog. Like, as an adult, having to cook for yourself to survive every single day, multiple times a day, like that's actually insane. Like, who let humans be this responsible? Like, I have to light a fire every single day to stay alive <sighs> my nails are in shambles like my life is in shambles i'm hungry what a great way to start the vlog i'm about to eat this at jump state and in the meantime i'm gonna go record i have to film my little tiktok which i'm dreading doing because hello nails are shambles what is my life currently nothing oh god is this where we left off <laughs> i saw it i so saw it i have been working all day um i edited so many reels like low-key my brain is like, nah. <laughs> um, recorded <sighs> the end of that video first thing tomorrow morning. And the point is, your girl was on the clock, okay? That clickety clock, honey. Um, is that glow off on my chin? Um, I have to go to Macy's. <laughs> so in the last vlog, I went to Macy's with my cousin. Um, and I picked up some things too while we're shopping for her. And I found these really cute heels from Smash Shoes that I was super excited about. Made plans to wear and everything. It was almost out the door when I looked down and realized I had two different sizes. And they did that to me for two of the shoes, about three pairs. Two of them are the wrong sizes. So they're on like a discount sale rack. So they only have one pair there. Then you go to them and they bring you the box and the other, the other pair. I got mine at 11 and they gave me 14s on both. Like y'all didn't even try. You didn't read the label. You didn't look at the box. Like <laughs> you didn't even try. You just grabbed whatever and brought it out to me. And if I was not in a rush, cause she, she didn't really want to be out and about that long. If I was in a rush, I should have known to check. Like to open the box and check all the shoes because things like this happen. And now I'm like hoping and praying that they still have the 11 cause I really want these shoes y'all. Like they're so good. Ugh. Like, look at it. Y'all know I love a strappy number. <laughs> um, and they felt like they would be relatively comfortable, more comfortable than the, my BCBG heels. I actually got rid of those because I just, they're not high, but there's no padding. At least this has a little something. The other ones have no padding, okay? Like, I can't do the whole no padding. Like, it's not, nothing about that is cute. Put some damn uh, styrofoam something inside. Stop playing. <sighs> Anyways, child. I'm gonna go to Macy's, beg and cry and plead for them to find me the other 11 because I need these in my life. Like, I try to get online, nothing. And because these are on the sale rack, I think it's whatever is left that's, you know, available. Cause I can't find it on the website. I can't find it on the Smash website. So this is my last hope to find these heels. I hate that for me. Um, and I have to go to Target also. So if I'm feeling up to it, after Macy's, if my heart isn't broken, then we'll go to Target. Um, but yeah, let me switch off my bags. So we can hit the road. Hit the road, Jack. 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 This is why I be losing stuff. I have stuff in every bag. Like, why is my life? Seriously. Hookah tips, perfumes, lotions, cream, sunscreen. <laughs> like, why is this my life? Oh, I'm forgetting something. Wallet, keys, phone. Wallet, keys, phone. It'll have to do, honey. It'll have to do. All right, y'all. Let's pack her up. 
Let's hit the road, Jack. <laughs> this better not be slow mo. Yeah, we good. Bag secured. Yes. I was worried that they wouldn't have my size available, but luckily they did. It was still there. And both shoes are now fully replaced. Very happy about that. Unfortunately, the white ones weren't available when I needed them, but at least now I have them from my closet. Especially since like, I got rid of my BCBG ones. <laughs> oh, the pain, child, the pain. This line has taught me my breath don't be stinking like <laughs> like my breath don't stink because like if you're not smelling your aligners like do you even have Invisalign <laughs> if you're not gonna sniff that tray when it comes out of your mouth are your teeth even getting fixed <laughs> That sounds so nasty. <laughs> but like, be for real though, like, be all the way for real. You never smell your tray? Or whatever it's called, you never? Cause one thing about me, I gotta be sure, like what is it getting? Is it calitosis? Cause like, you know, they be like, well you nose blind, you can't smell your own self. I <laughs> I don't ever be too close to anybody's face, you know? Like, even like partners. Cause I just never know, you know? I never had any complaints, but I just, I don't know. You know when you be watching like shows and stuff and they be like in your face talking to each other like, like they, you know, mm, real like boot up and talk to each other. I'm like, you're in that person's face. My breath is disrespectfully hot, oh my God. But like, I cringe. Cause I'm just like, I, I have no reason to ever be that close to my partner's face and speak. Like, I'm just too paranoid that that juicy AF tuna on croissant sandwich that I had three days ago is still there. <laughs> and I'll be damned if a man tell me my breast stink. First of all, your mama stink, how about that? But I don't know, y'all. This is the line. It just unlocked something, okay? Now I'm gonna be everybody face like this, okay? Like this, yeah. <laughs> like as trifling as it sounds, I know I can't be the only one that's ever done that. Like <laughs> I just have to be sure. I'm so sorry. I just have to be sure. <laughs> and now I am so. Mission accomplished. Cause your girl was doing a lot today, okay? And the breath is still giving fresh. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. The things that you say on the internet, like, let me log off for the day because this is getting out of hand. I already just told people I sniff. My liners, my goodness, Jamila, go to bed. Y'all, it is 1.45 in the morning. <laughs> and I wanna be upset when I'm struggling in three and a half hours to get to get up. Like, let's be for real, Jamima. You consistently don't make good choices. And you consistently get on camera and talk about it. And you consistently don't change. So at this point, let's not talk about it. <laughs> Okay, anyways, I'm going to brush my teeth, apply serum, moisturize, and hit the sack. See y'all tomorrow. <laughs> my breath is fresh, baby. 
So next time you see me in the street talking to somebody, something like this real close, real seductive, real romantic, yeah. Just know that breath fresh. Period. <laughs> Lord, don't cancel me, y'all. Don't block me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Good morning. It's us being back in the same exact spot for me. <laughs> um, but I went to bed late, like three o'clock once again. Overslept once again. <laughs> but we move. Um, I'm heading back to nail salon so I can fix my nails because because I need to work. And when my nails look like this, I cannot work. I cannot be on camera trying to do product displays like, come on. Speaking of which, I'm trying out new spray deodorant. I really liked the Dove one, but I found that I was alerted to it. And not even my armpit, but like right here, I would get like a little dry pass situation. And between that and the water in um, Jersey, my skin has been like bonkers. So since I've been back home, I stopped using that deodorant um, and it's fine now. So it was a deodorant. It's so annoying because I find such great deodorants, but my skin is just, ugh, like Lumi was great. I thought that Lumi was a problem because when I first started like having issues, um, but Lumi is such a great deodorant. Um, the Dove Spray is a great deodorant. The only one that is great and doesn't break me out is the regular Secret, but that's so boring. Like I feel like spray is like that girl now, you know? <laughs> so am I technically giving myself more problems? Yes. Probably shouldn't have sprayed that in a confined area. But today is the start of a new situation. I, what are these called? Are these aligners? I don't know, but yeah. We are officially starting week four. Can you believe it? Like, week four. I'm a pro around. Like, why is my gap not closed yet? Y'all played on my top, for real. Ooh, this one gonna hurt. I feel that one. Mm. Oh, this set is gonna hurt. It's not gonna be a good eating week for me. It's not. Oh! Again. Hey! I think it's locked and loaded. Wow. Anyways, yeah. I'm gonna run to this nail salon real quick so they can fix my nail so I can resume life as a person that looks like she cares about herself. <laughs> um, I want to go to my regular spot. With the nails up there that I, I love, but she's not in. And I need my nails done now, like today. <laughs> so, <sighs> apply your sunscreen, ladies. Apply your sunscreen, okay? And I feel all the pressure on this, the top right side right here. So, hopefully, my guy gonna be close by next week. Hopefully that means my gap is gonna close, honey, by next week. Bring some life back to the hair. I like to shape it a little bit with my hands. Um, yeah. And now we are off to get dressed. <laughs> Good morning, baby love. 
Good morning, sweetie. Sweetie bye. Sweetie baby. Alright. Um. Oof. Y'all. This is the quickest I ever edited a vlog. So your girl was up working. And I'm already done. Can't believe it. Love that for me. Which is great because I have a pile of laundry here that needs to be done. Um, man, one thing about going to the gym, <laughs> wow, the gym clothes that I amassed in laundry, as if I didn't already have enough, as if my day-to-day -day wardrobe and going out wardrobe was not enough to drown me in laundry. <laughs> but now I must add workout clothes too, like, bruv, bruv. Relax, okay? Relax. Um, actually, let me not sit like this because this is irritating my knee. But, yeah. Um, I have been putting away laundry for the past day and a half. Um, I just need to finish my workout clothes. I need to wash my bed sheets. And I'm really loving this comforter that I got from Amazon, like this particular shade. I have several of these comforters. You guys know I like to switch between, like, regular comforters and like duvets there's a time and place for everything when i have the energy to do all that and some i'm gonna do my little brooklyn and duvet okay my uh sateen duvet when i got it in me this amazon one she gonna do what she, what she needed to do and um i've been back on my white kick so it's like a super super light oatmeal-ish stone a light stone type of color it's not like pure white but I really like that so I want to wash this and put it right back right back on my bed um I have a lot of errands to run today I'm gonna take you guys with me um but usually when I have a, like a lot of things to do I end up not vlogging as much because vlogging like you would think oh you just put the camera up and you do what you need to do no it slows you down so much um I need to go to a TJ Maxx or a raw situation because I want new pillows my pillows are so deflated like it's giving no elevation <laughs> at all um, I can't find my king sized um, pillowcases like it's just a whole bunch of like little stuff that like I've been putting off and I feel like if I'm gonna go to the store to get pillows I might as well get king size pillowcases um, let me add it to my to-do list. Let's see, pillows, king size, pillowcase. What else did I need? I know I need to go grocery shopping for sure. For sure. Um, I actually need to, I'm gonna sit down, Jima, sit down and plan out your meals so you don't buy anything that you don't need and you don't forget anything that you need because you're good for that, okay? um i need to do a thrift store drop off um guys oh my gosh so i pretty much did like a deep clean situation of my closet it wasn't even all that deep honestly but like the amount of items that i purged from like my lounge wears pj closet and i blame timu <laughs> Because I feel like now that I done upgraded some of my sleep clothes, some of the danger pieces that I've been wearing for years, <laughs> I was like, oh, maybe I'm not in love with these the way I was before. Like, girl, if has holes in it, throw it away. <laughs> so I got rid of a, like, a lot of the danger things. That's not to be trash because that's like not even thrift store worthy. Um, and I didn't realize how much I was holding on to dingy things. <laughs> um, I mean, let's be for real though. Like, dingy things are usually like the softer, more comfortable things. And who doesn't want to be soft and comfortable when they're sleeping? Like, who doesn't want to be soft and comfy when they're sleeping, you know? Um, but now that I do have like new sleepwear and stuff, and I don't have too much space to house too many different things, so um, yeah, I had to make room for the new new. And even that didn't fit, I was like, let me just take it out. Like, let me just. 
we all have that drawer or those things at the back of the drawer or that one cubby or that one section with things that we don't reach for because they don't really fit but we don't want to get rid of yeah I, I had to get rid of those um that's in the thrift store pile so basically i've been trying to get my life together for the past couple of days and we will continue to do so today except this time you guys will be with me okay okay um i've been watching swat <laughs> there's a new season um I watched Virgin River. Um, I finished that season. Um, what else have I been watching? I feel like that's pretty much it. <laughs> I want to immerse myself into a life that's not real to escape my own. <laughs> but yeah, anyways. Back to slot. <laughs> yes, sir. That's how I store my sports bras. So I'm currently getting ready to head out. FYI, um, these are, ooh, y'all see my bathroom? I say, did I leave it a mess? <laughs> um, guess what, this is really not, this outfit is not in one accord. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna change my top because I don't know what's happening here. I really wanna wear the leggings though. I'm feeling comfy vibes today. I just a list of clothes I need to hang up. Do that when I get home. I'm just really focused on getting my apartment together today. Like, speak and span, honey. I don't think I need to draw for this, but whatever. This is from Target. I just love the color. Like, look how vibrant this pink is. Ugh. I don't know. I'm kind of like in the black on black mood. So let me see, did I get this from black too? I really hope I did. Yes, I did. So I just got these from Target. I'm actually gonna link these down below for you guys too because I like them. I actually really like them. Like this color is just so vivacious. I'm just in an all black mood, but like, we love this. We absolutely, it's stretchy, but like compressed. So, Beth, Beth, best of both worlds. Wow. Not Beth of both worlds. 
You know what? All them years I've been talking about, I'm getting a little tired of it, breaking promises, promises. Yeah, now it's not a joke. <laughs> yeah, now the joke is on you. <sighs> Lord. So, I just did my first errand. I dropped off the clothes. Oh, what time is it? I'm gonna run to Target real quick, so I have to do a return there. Y'all, I still can't find my freaking AirPods. <laughs> it's been months at this point. So I just gave in and bought a new one. But then I saw that Best Buy um, had the same AirPods for $50 off. So I said, ooh, $50 off. <laughs> and then I saw that they're coming out with a new um, AirPod, not a new one. It just has a different charging base. And I figured I would go ahead and wait until that was released. Um, for me to just get that one, especially since um, I ordered the iPhone 15 and I'll... Uh, one thing about Apple, they gonna um, switch up the, the, the charger on you, okay? So I'm like, let me go ahead and start migrating now. Ugh. <laughs> so annoying, but... Yeah, so now Target. I'm gonna grab some Starbucks on there and then um, head to Whole Foods to buy some groceries. Nothing crazy, nothing, not doing too much, just a little, a little something to fill in the gaps. Cause my HelloFresh order came in, so. Okay, we'll have it right yeah. for you. Hi, good morning. Hi. Um, can I please have a venti toasted vanilla uh, shake espresso with oat milk? Can I have, I the venti comes with six pumps of, can I have three instead? You can have it topped with um, the pumpkin cream. Yes. Alright, anything else for y'all? Um, that's it. Yeah, that's gonna be 816. I'm gonna ask you first if you're a target number. Okay, did my Target return and got my Starbies. New drink alert. So I got toasted vanilla oat milk shake and espresso, but I told them to cut the toasted vanilla syrup in half and add, they put a lot of that pumpkin cold foam stuff. Like that's a lot, um, but we're gonna see how it tastes. Um, Maybe I should have had them do less than three because I feel like the foam stuff is sweet too. And I feel like the six pumps is too sweet for me. Ooh la la. Ooh, ooh la la. Come on, let me open it so I can mix it better uh, oh my god all oh, the foam stuff is so good they put cinnamon on top oh wait a minute oh did i just do something please don't tell me i just did something i already come here too much i ordered from starbucks too much already like browsers Shout out to whoever suggested I put pumpkin, uh, pumpkin, uh, foam. I think they said to try it with the brown sugar espresso, though. So I'm going to do that next time, but, oh, she's good. Yeah. Delicioso. Oh, that's good. But low key, I feel like one pump of syrup is fine. Just get the flavor in it. Mm. Okay. Time to head to Whole Foods, baby. All right, just got to Whole Foods. I'm gonna get some essentials and then back to the casa we go.
down. I'm already, I'm done. Uh, one of the issues being the fact that I can't find my eye meds. And first my eye starts hurting, and then I get like an eye headache that can't be treated with anything else. And then my days are ruined. So if I cannot find these meds, I don't even want to think about it. I don't even want to think about it. So I'm just like, where, where do I put them? Like when I travel, I usually put it in my travel toiletry bag. When it's here, it's either on my nightstand or the bathroom. And I looked everywhere, it's not in neither. It's not in any of those places. Oh, God. oh what am I gonna do? Like, I can feel the eye pain already starting and I don't have time. Also, while I was at Whole Foods, I saw that they had this like pay with your palm situation. So I signed up for that. That's gonna be interesting. Also, this nail is breaking. It's already cracked. So I don't even know if I'm gonna make it to next week. Like, I'm praying I can make it to the weekend, but the posh is already starting to ship here. My girl can't ever leave me again, cause when it, she's the only one that gets me right consistently. She can never go to her kid's school appointment meeting ever again. Like, girl, I'm your child now. <laughs> I'm your child now, okay? You need to worry about me. <laughs> Lord, all right, let's put these groceries up. I pretty much got things to make sandwiches. I want a quick something. Um, I bought sauces to make two different kinds of pasta, red sauce or Haitian style and pesto. Y'all saw I got the Parmesan flakes, the Parmesan like flakes. <laughs> so I've never tried that. I've never tried the 365 brand of fake cheese either. So. Hopefully that's good. I have had child cheese slices, so that's why I got those for the sandwiches. Um, I got some chicken drummies because I'm gonna have like a movie night situation. I already have popcorn. Um, and then I have my Hello Fresh meals. I have fruits to snack on. I'm pretty much good for another week, y'all. Oh, I got some sweet potato cubes. As a side, some veggies. Oh, and I got some frozen rice to make chicken fried rice. I love to get shrimp, but <sighs> shrimp at Whole Foods is so expensive. Like that real stuff, man. <laughs> the real stuff be too pricey for me. Mushrooms. I got some more um, dairy-free cream cheese to go with my bagel. This is the pesto. I stocked up on my favorite sausages. Um, to put these in the pasta and stuff. And my, I can also do like pasta in the, um, not pasta, sausage in the chicken fried rice or sausage fried rice or just sausage and peppers with a side of rice. Like, you know, I just, I have options. I don't think I did too much. I tried to just think of stuff I would be eating this week. The only thing I feel like I probably didn't need as much of is a sausage, but. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> Everything else, like, I feel like this was a reasonable grocery haul for me. I have quick foods, I have medium foods, I have foods that'll take longer to cook. I have some chicken in the freezer, so I can always pull that out. Um, I bought milk, I can make oatmeal. I also bought this so I can try and make um, my frozen espressos. Not frozen, shaken. <laughs> Lord, um, I have energy drinks, I have coconut water, I have everything I need, I think, I think, um, so we should 
be good. I don't want to see another grocery store unless I'm cooking something very specific. I should be good. And I, for the, the movie night, I bought um, vegan cookies. I was like, this would be so cute to make like different shapes. I thought that's so cute. I would have the frosting girl because then I would have been like decorated with frosting, but I'm not. So it's just going to be a shape. And hopefully you can tell what it is just from that alone because, ugh, frosting. It's too sweet. It's too sweet. I got the Sweet Lauren's um, cookies from Target. Those are my fave. You never believe that they're vegan. Like, that's how, they're so good. <gasps> that's what I meant to look for. Those, you know what? I didn't eat them. Those damn vegan brownies at Whole Foods. <laughs> oh, they're so good. Anyways, y'all, that concludes our grocery haul. And, um, yeah. All right. I'm gonna upload my video real quick. Um, I have some admin things I need to do. And then we'll continue on with today's productivity. Okay, so I'm not done cleaning. My cleaning lady came, did her thing while I was, whoa, while I was like organizing, doing laundry, stuff like that. I changed the bed sheets. I'm about to go buy the pillows now. I got the sheets, not the sheets, the comforter and the dryer. And I use my dress, uh scent beads. It's gonna smell good, good, okay? Um, I told y'all about my closet already. Purged, organized. It's a lot of comforters. I'm gonna have to downsize that. I went through a phase. That's, that's enough on that. Um, bringing out these bad boys again. Gonna see if I can find pillow protectors for the big ones. I still have laundry to put away in here. Um, I don't have this room or my other room touched, so um, I'm going to handle that. I don't know if I'm going to get to that today. I hope I do, but cha, I'm exhausted. Uploaded my vlog. I'm going to start editing the next one tonight. I'm going to start getting ahead of things. It's just, uh, it's a lot. It's a lot. She cleaned his bathroom, but I need to purge some products and stuff that's here too. This is my content slash get ready with me. Um, bathroom. Why did I just stop? Why? Why? Okay, I switched my top to another Halera top. It's not the same shade of black. Um, but I wanted something looser, a little more comfy for me to run this second batch of airmen. Um, you know, y'all were with me when we went shopping for this bathroom. <sighs> Ask me what I've actually done. Absolutely nothing! Absolutely nothing! I also have to go to my brother's house today, so I might as well wait until right before he's about to get home to make the the, the store run. Or should I go to him first so I don't have stuff in my car, then go to the store and then come back? That way, right now, I can focus on laundry. <sighs> Just never ending laundry. period hello i have some packages that i need to unbox so we might as well get to it baby so i got some new flowers um to replace the coolets i'm on facetime with kim right now kim you know i try to get it from amazon what your flowers Girl, let me see if they're the right ones. It's not. It's giving malnourished underfed, so I just got a new kind. It's just that they feel real, right? The, the flowers are life. Best flowers you ever buy. 
I mean, it's, oof, they smell plastic, but that's all right. I ripped them out of the plastic because they looking brand new. <laughs> but yeah, and this time I got two so that it'll fill the vase up. I'm sorry, the buzz. <laughs> Rip me out the plastic. And I feel like I prefer the look of the um the tulips, but I mean this will do. So yeah, I got two packs of those. But I was like, damn, I should have gone to Marshall's. But then I already had a full suitcase. There was no way for me to bring it home. And then I bought this um, this sunglasses hanging situation. Because right now my storage is just a hot mess. Where do I even have space to hang this from? I don't know. I don't know. Stop asking me questions I don't have the answer to. Well, this is what it looks like. Let's put in the arm right here and the hangs and it's just a whole bunch of these. Yeah, eventually y'all figure out how to... I feel like this being more than $7 is a scam. Like this is giving five below material. And I feel like I paid like 17 or something. I don't know for sure. It's like felt material like. But I needed it, so whatever. My loss. Y'all know I love Kurt Geiger. Did I add more to my collection? Yes. Are you judging me right now? You better not be. Anyways, child. Um, rip me out the plastic. Rip me out the plastic. I've been acting brand new. Okay, so let's see how they look. How they look. Oh yeah. So I ordered this one because I low-key like have a little outfit in mind. Um, it was another bag that I really wanted, but there weren't too many ways that I could wear it easily. So I didn't take the plunge. I might end up going back for it at some point, especially because I find that with Kurt Geiger bags, like eventually they'll stop making it and they'll like make other designs and stuff. But I, see you Kurt and I see this bag I like the detailing on it she's just cute so that's for the collection and then you guys I really loved I really loved the gold one and that was one that I've been eyeing for a very long time before I finally took the plunge and I loved it so much I said you know what Jima I know you said you're not gonna buy another silver bag but they're so good. They're so good. Like, I really thought I'd be over my silver phase by now, but I'm just not. Like, look how stunning this bag is. Like, are you not gagging? Like, quite literally gagging. Like, look at the... It's just so pretty. So the base is black and white, and it has the silver rhinestone sequins, whatever they are on them. Just beautiful, 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 beautiful. Last, but most certainly not least, I purchased a phone holder. Interesting concept, but I thought I would give it a try for those days where I'm, you know, outside shaking my arse and I don't necessarily want a bag. Or if I do have a bag, most of my phones don't fit in my bag. <laughs> so I can have my bag and also have my phone hanging in this vacuum so i'm pretty sure it works something like this oh oh now my now my phone being too small oh y'all gonna have to run that coin back but is this not how it's supposed to be y'all is lit lit literally ripping oh shoot not that made this for the baby iphone oh Oh, 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 I've been bamboozled. I've been bamboozled. Cause why would y'all not make one I could fit all phones? But I mean, look how cute it is though. Like it's too bad I really can't repurpose this. Cause like, what? Can you imagine me like on the phone? Like this thing, like, oh my God, beautiful, it's funny. Yeah, y'all got this bad. Run me my coins back. Oh, not my first 
Disappointment from Kurt. <gasps> wow. Shocked and appalled. I am shocked and appalled. Let me see. Can I even return with this? You return for please. We got prepaid. We love a prepaid label. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Ooh, already making a mess, child. Bring me out the plastic. I mean, I can brand new. Um. Okay. So, I've been tagging them in a lot of my posts lately, and they reached out. They reached back out to give me some products. They've gifted me a few things in the past. Um. But I wanted to. Oh, okay. They, they, I feel like they gave me things like that. What happened? They usually have like a, a small like list of things that they want you to pick from. Oh, this is definitely bigger than I thought. Oh, this is way bigger than I thought. So, we have this one here. This one gives me Edward Scissorhands. Like heavy. So, I figured this is giving like edgy, biker chic look. Um, and this is brown. This is what she looks like. And then we have this mini situation here. They're very big on this like rainbow scheme at Kurt. Um, oh, even though the rhinestones on the bird is like colorful. That's fun. And then, oh, not a card. Jamima. Oh, shoot. First and last name. Dang. Yeah. We see some items from our newest uh, fast fall. Fashion Week 23 collection. Chill. Not me. Uh, struggling. Your friends at KG. Thank you, Kurt Geiger. And then I got the extra big bag. Like this. Okay, perfect. Uh, and the all black. All black hardware. All black everything. Because, yes. Um, this is giving where I'm running to the coffee shop with my laptop and iPad. Just real quick. Real quickly, quick, quick, quick. The hardware is solid. And I love that they have the metal around this portion right here, the keyhole, so that this is always solid. So I feel like this could hold some some weight. Okay, I'm gonna add this to my tote bag collection for sure. Cute, 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 cute. Okay, and that is it for the gifted items from Kurt. Bring me out the plastic. I'm acting brand new. Oh my God. What is that? Oh my God. <laughs> um, I have some few things from Amazon. I don't know if I show you guys. Should I show you guys now? No, cause like, once I go, I have like two or three Amazon favorite videos full of things to show y'all. So I feel like if I discover anything popping right now, do I want to try to know already? Or do I want to try to wait for the video? Oh, yes. Okay. So y'all know that now that my hair is down my back, my baseball caps don't fit me the way I like for them to fit me. So I think that visors might be on the new wave. Yikes. Is it? Is it? Yeah. I mean, is it giving cha 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 chia? Is it giving houseplant? Yes to all the above, but I'm not mad. Um, because something about having a hat on just makes me feel like I'm invisible and I'm mysterious and I love that. I just feel like I need something, very much something, okay? So I'm working on my advisor collection now. Um, I ordered some new retainer cases because it was kind of annoying to travel with the only one that I have. Um, because, especially because y'all know I don't unpack immediately. <laughs> I think I've done that once and I just have never done it since. So this is a two pack. I think it was like 13 bucks or something. Um, so I can just have one in my purse so that I can stop putting my retainer, not my, my retainer, my aligners in paper towels and also want to keep in my travel bag so that I'm just always stopped. Okay, since it's my life for the next 15 months. God. Ordered new goggles. Instructor approves, said she roasted my last ones and said, be for real. I also tried to get some, um, is this it? 
I got goggles that were like prescription-ish um, so that I can see under the water without wearing my contacts. Is this one it? Child, I don't know. I got one regular one and I got um, one with like optimized eye stuff. So hopefully that works. Um, I picked up a hard drive. Um, I've been having issues, which I shouldn't be with the amount of storage I have on my laptop, but I found a folder that I had not emptied since I bought the laptop. And I kind of wish I had waited until I figured everything out before I purchased this um, hard drive, but that's fine. I'm still debating if I want to move my Final Cut Pro software to my hard, my, uh, I'm sorry, hard drive. <laughs> Cause that means I have to always have it with my laptop when I'm editing. I'm just like, ugh. I like the simplicity of just having everything ingrained into my laptop. This makes life easier. Um, but Final Cut Pro takes a toll on your laptop. You know, it's the, the more reason why I invested so much money into it to begin with to handle it. And I feel like if I just regularly empty out the folders I need to empty out and keep the the memory low, I should be okay. But just in case. Um, I'm gonna upload a copy of my library to the hard drive just in case better safe than sorry read me out the plastic read me read me so like I said um, I'm preparing myself for the migration of the um, USB port so I went ahead and um, got some extra charging cables um, from Best Buy because listen one thing about it I I live for convenience, okay? I don't know how people will be surviving with just one charger. I can't do it, okay? I need a charger in every room, okay? And I need it easily accessible. People are like, oh, you have an extra charger? Let me have one. No, it's not extra, okay? I specifically, okay, specifically bought that charger for that spot. Ooh. The S. Specifically. Pacific Ocean? Yeah. You see, it be your own friends. You got a fast charger for Amazon? I got a, a regular charger. Oh, girl. Amazon sell the knockoffs for in the pack. I got one in every room now. So if somebody come here, charge it in the room. And if it go missing... You, you know why it's four in a pack? Because it be messed up after four days. No, I have mine for a month. Bring me out the plastic. I said, bring me out the plastic. Oh, okay. So I got this. Y'all, my I don't know about y'all, but like my back be killing me when I'm laying on a table, like like on a massage table or a like facial table. So I got this firm back support thingy. Um, and I'm really I'm really hoping that it helps alleviate the pain because when I tell y'all the struggle to get off the table afterwards, it's actually embarrassing. And I'm really glad that people leave so you can get off so they don't watch or hear your pain. <laughs> so I'm really hoping this does a trick. And I like that it came with a little strap situation because it's almost like, okay, girl, grab your purse, grab your pillow purse and let's go. Cause I'm long overdue for my facial. Y'all know that facial got me right and tight, honey worth every single coin so i'm overdue and need to be back but i want to make sure i ordered this and had this ready to go before but that's pretty much it for this haul um we're gonna hit the streets soon so stay tuned for that i also got kitchen shears because mine started rusting so i upgraded can you cut can you cut out of these
pasta. Girl, make sure we're not on slow mo. Um, I thought these would be a slightly better match, but it's good enough. Um, I felt like I got the two essential pots. I wish they did have like a smaller fry pan um, or a smaller like saucepan as well, but I'm gonna try another store later on this week to see if they have more of these sets because I've never seen this color scheme before. And they also like a tealish one. Super excited to find this, so I like, I like. And I found the cutest pumpkin. Oh, like my thing is so cute. And it likes that, like the FFR. Like I don't even need it, but as soon as I saw it, I said, I need it. Oh my gosh. Oh, she wrapped it up good, okay. But look how cute she is with the, the gappy smile and then with the light inside come on is this not everything so stinking cute all right let me see I'll take this wrapper out i'm just like oh my god you know when the lights are dimmed dim low put this on Child, how am I supposed to uh, get this dang on thing out? Oh, my fingers are too fat for this. Like, please, please, just come out. Like, stop making me work for it. My fingers cannot fit through this gappy smile. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I think I'm actually gonna leave it here on the island. I think, I'm not sure. At some point, I'm gonna actually like decorate my apartment. I just been slacking on it, honestly. But I will get my life together. But um, oh shoot, these new scissors I got popping, popping. Like be for real. <laughs> so cute. Oh, I'm so glad I saw this. Seven ninety nine at Marshalls. Love her life. Yes, darling, yes. All right, y'all. Anyways, y'all saw that I, I found the pillow covers, thank goodness. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my bed together so that I can hop into it, okay? Take a shower, take a nice steaming hot shower, do a nice little scrub and hop into the bed. I am ready to end this night, y'all. Like, but I got so much done today. I'm so happy about it. So happy about it. Um, stay tuned for the next vlog because I will be getting into more fall things. So I hope you guys enjoy. I ended up not liking those flowers that I got, so I'm gonna stick with these. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with these. I put them in and I was like, oh. I do not like that. Not unless they're real. But yeah, that's it for tonight, y'all. I'm gonna wind down, take a beautiful shower. Mm. Use one of my Bath and Body Works shower steamers and crawl into my soft, delicious bed with fresh sheets. And on that note, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this vlog and I will see you in the next one. Toodles. <laughs>